As we approach the seven year anniversary of the 2015 flood, the city of Forest Acres is helping another community that just experienced a similar crisis. Here's Peyton Lewis. Here in the city of Forest Acres, Police Chief Don Robinson says they understand the meaning of how far the basics can go and how far they need to go now. The ride there is about a nine hour ride. So what we're going to do is we're going to meet them probably halfway because we understand the impact and the assistance and the aid that we receive from other people and we want to pay this forward. A nine hour drive all the way into eastern Kentucky where Letcher County has been trying to stay afloat. And just like Letcher, Forest Acres has had its dark days too. The water was up to the, almost to the window here. That much water. Could you imagine that much water here? In 2015, Forest Acres experienced a once in 1,000 year flood. And Councilman David Black says the city wanted to help give another place a leg up in their recovery. Even today, you still kind of drive around and you see some of the things that, you know, we're still building. I think this is a great idea, especially with the flood that we had. I said, hey, this is something that we can do. Reach out to people in Eastern Kentucky and really help them. The Forest Acres Police Department will be donating a patrol car to the Letcher County Sheriff's Office and making the drive to meet them within the next few weeks. But before they go, they're asking for help from those living in Forest Acres. As much as we can get, we're gonna take up there. We've kind of run the gamut so far. We've received some clothes, um, but really specific, what we'd like to have is non-perishable food items. Uh, that's the main thing, and probably diapers, toiletries, um, anything for health, hygiene, and, and food. We, that's what we want to provide. And with a patrol car and donations in hand, Forest Acres hopes to show the Letcher community that there are brighter days ahead. Reporting in Forest Acres, Peyton Lewis, News 19 WLTX. And if you have any items you would like to donate to help with flood recovery efforts in Kentucky, you can take them to the Forest Acres City Hall or to the Police Department lobby.